Quail, without my gun in my pocket, I will slap the fuck out of your bum ass. You are a oh, bum, man. my guy. Okay? There's nothing that oh, you can do God. to me physically. I will fuck Tell you me. up physically. Like, literally. I'll grab you by your goddamn neck. Hey, Mark, you can't hey, Mark, have hey, it, man. Hey, Mark, hey, Mark, hey, Mark keep, it, hey, keep it professional. Man, I'm just, I'm just, I just wanted him to know that. My quill. Yeah, we're going. Why you been talking? Why you been talking shit about me, man? Oh shit! What the fuck? <laughs> what what what's the point of that? Who told you that? Who told you? That? <laughs> Yeah, if it didn't seem to tell you anything, if it didn't seem to tell you when she shows you all her life and all this shit, you feel me? Okay, so I'm going to put it like this. If you had a problem with you, bro, I'll pull up on you and tell you I got a problem with you. You know what I'm saying? So, it's a lot of shit going around about you. you speaking on me, all type of shit. Yeah, everything. I've never, you know? I've never, I've never said a word about you. If you I mean, knew how busy my if you knew how busy my life is, you know that I really don't have time for like anything like that or nothing like that. I'm gonna be go, go all the time. Matter of fact, I'm probably only gonna be in here for a few minutes because I have something to do at eight thirty. Okay, I have something to do at eight thirty. I have something to do at ten a.m. Go I'm ahead, I can barely hear you. Say it again. I'm gonna be real with you. If I had a problem with you, bro. I don't even know you like that. Anyway, my boy. So whatever you're in in these streets, you need to go check them people because they don't know what I'm hearing. It's not what I'm hearing. I've seen I've seen the comments come from you. Okay. I'm saying what you hearing though. You, you, you tell me what you hearing. Or you just saying you stand the So, to me. so listen, to I'm, I'm gonna say this one time, man. I'm gonna say this one time. So. I want to shout out to everybody that is a part of the Atlanta Street Interviews sphere that has kind of been created here on YouTube. So shout out to everybody, man, that, you know, has basically, you know, kind of a lot been, you know, from their involvement or reporting on Atlanta Street Interviews platform have, you know, gotten some level of motion, Most, have gotten oh, some hey, level of, you know, hey, saying, whatever it is they have going on. So. I want to shout out everybody for that. What's what's going on, Rita? <laughs> I want to shout out everybody for that, but I, I do want to say this, okay? I do want to say this. Um, you know, for folks who who feel the way about me or whatever, I don't mind you feeling the way about me, but understand, understand that if whatever emotion that you have when you you know because you was on my platform, listen. Have a little bit of, you know, have a little bit of regard for that. Have a little bit of regard for that. In other words, like my quail, listen, dude, you know, I don't really know you like that. You don't really know me like that. You reached out to me. We did the interview, everything else. Um, I've, you know, I've noticed that sometimes you kind of, you know, you get in your emotions about things and you're quick to get, you know, to anger and stuff like that. So it may have been during some of those times that you was kind of feeling the way or talking shit, or whatever it is. But I'm going to say this, man. You know, <laughs> like, there's no need to talk shit. There's no need to talk shit. And there's definitely no need to backpedal. I saw you talking shit about me, so if, if you was talking shit, be a man and stand on that shit. Yeah, Otherwise than that, I don't yeah, respect you. Yeah, I said everything I said. Did you have your girlfriend using you as a threat, but you got so some type of weapon, like in, like somebody scared that weapon. Like, like my weapon, my quail, my quail, my quail. Let me let me explain something to you, man. Let me explain. Something. I'm gonna I'm say this one time, and y'all know I'm not this type of guy. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and, and and say this because I am from Belvedere. Okay, I just want him to know that just in case he thought that the gun or the pistol or anything else, you you the type of guy, you the type of guy that talk that talk behind somebody back. And then want to sit here and try to backpedal. And then when I call you out on it, now you want to talk. Now you want to have other people's name in your mouth. Okay? Check this out. Here's the real deal. Because I'm about to go. Here's the real deal. The real deal is you're a begging ass bum. You're a begging ass bum that I gave a platform to. And now you want to sit here and try to backpedal on me. Okay? Now you want to sit here and try to backpedal on me. Now you want to sit here and try to backpedal on me. And now you want to sit here on YouTube and be talking shit to women and be backpedaling and arguing with all type of folks and shit like that. I don't respect that shit. So the next time that you see me, you come on downtown, the next time you see me, say that shit to my face 
like how I say it to your face. Okay? I'll be down today. Salute to the chain. Salute to my guy right here, Eric Brunson, man. Salute to you, Bob's Queen. I don't listen to all that stuff. I don't listen to all that Bob stuff. I say what I had to say, and that's that, man. All right? Hey, listen, y'all have a good morning. Definitely have a great Tuesday. God bless. I'm about to go do the same thing, all right? God bless. All right. Take care. Yeah, the day's going to be wild.